What is up guys, Killer here and today back with another episode of Fallout 4 Mods and today we are going to be looking at the next generation Minutemen's general uniform. That's pretty much a mouthful right there. This mod does look freaking sexy as you can tell by the thumbnail. If you haven't seen the thumbnail and just randomly click on this video then uh, you're in for a little bit of a treat. So guys, obviously if you do want the mod it is down in the description below. Make sure to go and click those links to the proper website. It will take you there, download it, bada bing bada boom and it's all yours. So without further ado, let's crack on with the mod itself. So guys, there's two different ways of getting this mod. Usually there's one, but there's actually two ways of getting it. The first is obviously the most easiest, which is obviously spawning in, which we're probably going to do. But if you've already got the Miniman outfit, I don't know how you get it, if I'm perfectly honest. You're going to come down to this sort of bit here. And as you can tell here, it requires a Miniman general uniform and a general's hat. And after that, you can obviously make the improvements through a small amount of requirements and grab it. But if you just want it straight off the bat, all you're going to need to do is go help. Minutemen space 4 and it should prompt this thing up here and as you can tell here by the one below the first one is the actual new armor and below that is the actual new hat as well so you didn't actually need to craft any of it or retain any of it if you just want it thrown in your infantry then this is probably the best way to do it so I'm actually going to grab this I'm going to go player dot add item and uh, I'm going to grab all that says 0a 00800 space 1 because obviously you want one of it as well uh, not saved throughout that okay that's a little bit weird maybe I need to do the capital so player dot add item and then let's go is that a zero or an A? I'm pretty sure it's a zero zero A one two three eight one one space one there we go and obviously the hat is obviously going to be changed the last zero to a one and there we go there we go the full outfit is now in our infantry i'm very optimistic to see this by the way because obviously it did look freaking damn sick i wonder if there's any detailing we can look a look on this beautiful that kind of looks pretty damn cool it kind of fits in with the sort of our sort of uh, army outfits we've done before as well again great for a stealth gameplay i'm not gonna lie i don't know why i keep saying that purely because there's so many things that do fit in with that kind of genre and obviously let's have a look at the hat as well black and gold who doesn't like that the detailing as well is absolutely sick some on the front there obviously the trim and on the top of the hat as well which is awesome let's obviously come out and have a little look boom there it is it does look kind of menacing as well which is pretty damn cool but yeah Freaking damn sick. So let's obviously go obviously into TFC 1. And uh, let's have a look a look at this. So again, they've done a beautiful job on the boots here as well. There's a lot of mods that I've done before, and I know I keep bashing it, but there's one mod in particular. I'm not going to say what it is, purely because I've bashed it too many times. Uh, their boots on that mod were absolutely terrible. Everything else on it was absolutely amazing. It just ruined it with the boots. These boots, though, are freaking damn sick. As you can tell here, there's a little, lots of detail throughout the whole boot as well. So the curves and the waves. Of course, there's a cut few little buckles within here, which are awesome. And some buckles on the side as well, which is damn cool as well didn't even realize that some nice ripped jeans as well but just overall it just looks freaking damn sick look how menacing this looks what you need now is sort of a, a big old skull for a head and just make sure it's red <laughs> like a red skull outfit this is freaking damn sick the amount of pockets as well as yeah, there's a nice little I'm not too sure what that is I'm not sure why I'd have a nice chunky little bit of rope back there that's pretty damn weird but besides that it does look freaking damn sick about a thousand pockets as well Obviously the Minimen logo, I believe that is on the chest there, on the right of the chest. The hat as well is just awesome. I love these hats. I don't know why, but just people that sort of make these hats, you know, they're just beautiful. I love those hats so much. But yeah, it's, I must say, there's a lot of pouches on this, but it just fits in with it beautifully. What's that on that sort of like a little shackle or a bracelet or something? That's pretty damn weird. That's cool. But again... The amount of detailing is absolutely flawless throughout this whole entire thing. So yeah, I'd probably recommend this for maybe sort of a, I don't know, like a, I'm going to say military, because it is kind of military, to be honest. It's kind of like a military outfit. Again, looks beautiful. Um, yeah, I, you can't really say too much about this. It kind of speaks for itself. I would really do like this mod, though. It does look freaking damn sick. Um, yeah, recommend this 100%. As you can tell, you've got patches on the chest, you got one on the left arm or his right arm, and obviously on his left arm, you've got a pouch there. 
but besides that, it does look freaking damn cool. Obviously, with a cool weapon mod here, or even sort of some throwing knives, which I believe we've already covered. If not, they're coming to the channel very soon. Then this is probably your best bet for that. But guys, if you did enjoy this, make sure to hit me up with a like and a comment. But uh, yeah, let me know if you're going to get this one as well, guys. Um, let me know if you're going to infuse it with sort of like your other army outfits or anything like that. I'd really like to know. Let's have a chat in the comment section below. But until the next one, guys, get a cafe and get a get out.